Welcome to the module on Key ABDM Components. In this module, you will learn about the key components of ABDM. By the end of this module, you will Understand ABHA and its benefits Understand Healthcare Professionals Registry HPR, and Health Facility Registry HFR. Learn Registration Process for HPR and HFR. To know the working of ABDM, it is crucial to understand its key components, which include ABHA, Healthcare Professionals Registry, HPR, Health Facility Registry, HFR, Health Information Exchange Consent Manager, HIECM or Consent Manager, and Unified Health Interface, UHI. In this module, we will cover the first three components of ABDM, ABHA, HPR, and HFR. In the next module, we will cover the remaining two key ABDM components along with the ABDM Digital Health Ecosystem Partners. Meet Rahul, a young man who lives in Muradabad in India. He runs a grocery store that his father has set up and lives with his wife and parents in their ancestral home. Rahul is an avid user of UPI and Aadhaar which are large programs launched by the Government of India that has had a transformational impact on India. Rahul has taught his parents how to use UPI to pay small shops and vendors for their goods and services. In his hometown, Rahul has witnessed how Aadhaar is enabling the poorest Indians and those living in the most remote corners to get access to government subsidies directly into their bank accounts. Let us first understand the concept behind ABHA and how individuals like Rahul can avail its benefits. Ever since Rahul came to know about ABDM, he is really excited to learn how he and his family members can participate in ABDM. He visits his family physician, Dr. Rashid, to learn about it. Dr. Rashid explains to him that any individual can participate in the ABDM ecosystem by just creating their unique health identifier, ABHA. In fact, everything that occurs on ABDM revolves around ABHA, which is a 14-digit unique number. Rahul finds the idea of the ABHA interesting and wants to learn more about it. Dr. Rashid explains to Rahul that the ABHA acts like a bank account. Just as a bank account records financial transactions and creates a personal financial history, ABHA records health transactions and helps build health history. ABHA links an individual's health records across health facilities and healthcare professionals and allows the individual to exchange the same across the ecosystem. Once Rahul creates his ABHA, he will be able to link his health records across all clinics, hospitals, labs and even pharmacies. All he needs to do is just give his ABHA or ABHA address while availing any of the healthcare services. A new entry will be made linking Rahul's ABHA or ABHA address for a lab test or a doctor's visit. Rahul seems a bit apprehensive about his privacy and asks Dr. Rashid where all his health records would be stored. Dr. Rashid explains to him that under ABDM, all health records are saved at the source of creation. For example, the lab report remains with the lab, the prescription remains with the doctor or hospital. The consent manager supports fetching such records with Rahul's consent through an online reference. Patients can store their digital health records on health lockers and can access and share such records on requirement basis. It means that Rahul can choose which lab record or prescription he would like to share with Dr. Rashid and for how long. Rahul is now satisfied with the data privacy provisions inbuilt in ABDM. I'm sure you must be wondering how Rahul or for that matter, any individual can get ABHA created. We are going to discuss this next. ABHA can be created by self-registration and assisted mode. Here, we will learn about how to create the ABHA through self-registration mode. In self-registration mode, ABHA can be created using an Aadhaar card or a driving license on the ABDM website or any ABDM enabled app. 
An individual can create ABHA using Aadhaar card in four easy steps through the ABDM website. Visit the ABDM website and click the Create ABHA button. Next, select any one of the options using Aadhaar or using Driving License. Click on Using Aadhaar and enter your Aadhaar number. Give consent by clicking on I agree and click Next. You will receive the OTP on mobile number linked with your Aadhaar. Enter it and click Next. After Aadhaar authentication, enter your mobile number and click Next. You will see your profile already filled in the ABHA form. Your ABHA number has now been created. Now, next step is to link the ABHA address. ABHA address is easy to remember address similar to a user ID. It is either user generated or default address in the format XYZ at the rate ABDM. After filling the ABHA address, click on Submit. Congratulations, you have successfully created your ABHA. You can also download your ABHA by clicking the download button. In the case of our driving license, a reference number is generated and the individual needs to visit the nearest ABDM enabled facility with original license to create ABHA. Now, let us learn how to generate ABHA using ABDM enabled app. First, download ABDM enabled app like Arogya Setu from the App Store on your mobile phone. Click on register to create the ABHA number and ABHA address. Next, enter your Aadhaar number and verify the OTP. Next, click on register and set your ABHA address. ABHA address is easy to remember. User generated or default address in the format XYZ at the rate ABD. We have just seen two modes of self-registration of ABHA. In the assisted mode, you can just walk into ABDM-enabled facilities like government or private hospitals, community health centers, and health and wellness centers and request the staff to help create ABHA. We would like to mention that it is possible for one individual to have multiple ABHA addresses, which may be useful in case of certain situations. In summary, it is easy to create ABHA and start availing the benefits of ABDM. In this section, we are going to discuss the second key component of the ABDM, the Healthcare Professionals Registry, HPR. We will also understand how health service providers can register for HPR. Before moving further, let's first understand what is HPR. HPR is a comprehensive repository of registered and verified healthcare professionals across all systems of medicine. HPR is applicable for doctors, nurses, paramedics, lab technicians and other healthcare professionals across India. So, what are the advantages of HPR for medical professionals like Dr. Rashid? Well, there are multitudes of benefits of HPR for healthcare professionals. Credibility Government of India verified list of healthcare professionals and their credentials will be available online. Discoverability Due to increased visibility of healthcare professionals, individuals and patients can find healthcare professionals online and thus enhancing the doctor's practice. Teleconsultation Doctors can engage with more patients through teleconsultation, which saves time and efforts of patients and doctors. Connectivity Doctors can connect with other doctors in hospitals. Over time, HPR is envisaged to evolve into a practitioner-centric platform that provides benefits like getting online renewal of licenses, obtaining no-objection certificate by other governing bodies, tracking continuing education points, etc. in accordance with global best practices. Let us understand how healthcare professionals can generate their healthcare professionals ID or HPID for registering in HPR by following the two simple steps. Enrolling on the ABDM website by visiting hpr.abdm.gov.in and initiating the enrollment process. Submitting the required documents. Enter the required demographic, educational, specialization and work-related details. Enrolling on the ABDM website. Visit the URL hpr.abdm.gov.in. Click on the link for registering new HPID. 
select Aadhaar or driving license to generate the ID. Let us now learn how to generate HP ID via Aadhaar following the steps given below. Click on the button Generate via Aadhaar. Enter the Aadhaar number and accept the terms and conditions and then click Submit. Verify the Aadhaar with OTP. Enter the mobile number and verify it with OTP. After the mobile number verification, select the Healthcare Professional category. Choose your HP ID name and password with which one will register in the HPR and click Submit. The HP ID will be successfully generated. This can be used to register in HPR. Submit the required documents. Submit all personal, registration and work-related details. Before the final submission, review your details and submit the form to ABDM for verification. Before starting the process of registration in HPR, please keep the required documents handy for faster registration. Personal details which include profile information, address for KYC, communication address and contact information. Registration details which include the system of medicine, medical council registration details and certificate and qualification details such as degree certificate, diploma certificate, etc. Work-related details which include speciality, current work-related details such as proof of employment. In the case of government employees, additional documents like an appointment letter, a most recent payslip and a transfer order must be submitted. Further, the verification of the submitted details are carried out by the respective councils or bodies and the state or UT administration for government healthcare professionals. Healthcare professionals can register and verify automatically in HPR through their records available with Council and Aadhaar. Let's look at the following steps to register via the Council Search feature. Click on For New User and select your registration council. Fill in your registration number, category and subcategory and click Submit. On submission, the basic information will be auto-populated. Next, provide your Aadhaar and click Verify Aadhaar. On verification, your records will be successfully fetched. Then, create the Healthcare Professional username and proceed further. You will find your details pre-filled. Recheck all details such as qualifications and current work and fill in other mandatory fields. On completion of the form, click Save and Next. Tick the declaration form and click Submit. You can use eSign to complete the form. You will receive a message showing the successful submission of the application. To know more about the HPR registration process in details, visit the link. This is an important exercise to ensure that only qualified healthcare professionals are assigned an HP ID. Once qualified medical professionals get their HP ID, they are all set to participate in the ABDM ecosystem and get connected to their patients, other doctors and hospitals who are also part of ABDM. The Health Facility Registry HFR, is the third key component of ABDM. Health facilities like hospitals, clinics, labs, pharmacies can avail the benefits of ABDM by registering themselves on Health Facility Registry or HFR and creating their facility ID. HFR is a comprehensive repository of registered and verified health facilities such as hospitals, clinics, labs, pharmacies, etc that help connect and deliver various healthcare services digitally across India. Let's look at the steps to be followed to create Facility ID for registering in HFR. To get Facility registered, visit facility.abdm.gov.in. Log in to HFR as a Facility Manager using the HP ID. Fill the registration form. Enter the facility details and complete the form. Review and submit the form for verification. On submission, a facility ID will be generated. All facility information is considered as self-declared on submission. The location of the facility is then verified by respective state or union territory government officials, councils or bodies for registration. Before starting the process of registration in HFR, please keep the required documents handy for faster registration. Clear photographs of your health facility. 
building photograph and board photograph. Address proof in the case of private and public-private partnership facilities. The address proof may include CEA registration certificate, electricity bill, water bill, landline telephone bill, rent agreement, title deed, property or land record, any other proof as accepted by the respective state or union territory authorities. Visit the following link to learn more. Let us summarize the points covered in this module. ABHA is a unique health identifier to link, access and share health records. HPR is the repository of registered and verified healthcare professionals on ABDM. HFR is the repository of registered and verified health facilities on ABDM which includes hospitals, clinics, labs, pharmacies, etc. For more information on ABDM, visit the ABDM website and follow us on our social media handles.